the DMO Nay, and I'm back and I'm better. What you talking about? It's like, no. But I'm back with another video. Um, if you're new to my channel, make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe. Turn on post notifications so you'll be notified of my next post. And yeah, as you can see, I am back at my dorm. I was on break and now I'm back. That's why I wasn't really doing anything, which is not really like logical. But yeah, today I decided to pull the camera out and vlog because it's a Saturday and I didn't feel like being cooped up in here. I want to go do something. I got money for Christmas and I did not use it. I used it for groceries for this dorm. That's it. And I really want to, you know, go shopping and pick up some new items because bro i'm sick and tired of my clothes like i really am starting to not like my clothes and i just cleaned my closet out like um earlier in 2021 you know i made the video and there's nothing else to clean out like i like the stuff i have i'm just tired of wearing it so i wanted to hit up a thrift store or two i don't know and then go to the mall so i might go to one thrift store and go to the mall and i'm going to american thrift in Pacific. New Jersey, yeah, and I don't know which mall I'm gonna go to yet. I need to go to a nice one. Actually, I might go to Garden State Plaza because if I'm not mistaken, I think it's in Passaic as well, so that makes sense. And plus, Garden State Plaza has all the stores I wanna go to. So yeah, today is gonna be a nice little thrift with me, shop with me. That's what we're gonna call this video, a shop with me. Cause I always take thrift with me, but I'm going to the mall too. So I'm gonna say this is a shop with me video and I'm bringing you guys along. And then I might show you guys what I picked up, you know, at the end of this video. So yeah, you know, I wanna be more productive again. Um, I'm just, I don't like when I'm not productive on YouTube. Like, even though I just be lazy and I don't be doing it, I don't enjoy, I don't enjoy it because I wanna post for you guys and stuff. So, yeah, and thank you guys for getting me to 6K, even though I was not posting anything. Like, y'all are fine. <laughs> y'all are fine for that. But, yeah, we're on the road to 10K, and I'm excited for that. Don't mind my stuff in the back. I told y'all I just moved in, and I did not take none of the stuff out the bins. My room is not a mess. It's just the bins. But, yeah, we're about to go. Got my candy. So, I'll see you guys when I'm in the car or either when... I'm at the store. Ooh, get into it. Y'all know that song that be like, mm -mm 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 -mm, fooling around. <laughs> that song is stuck in my head. I just made a TikTok to that song. But, uh, as y'all can see, I'm in the car. It's a light. Whew! I'm about to start it. And I'm gonna let the car warm up. Rule number one of having a car when it's cold, make sure you warm it up because you're gonna mess the car up. Listen, I didn't listen to that last year. This year, I'm a new girl. I warm my car up. <laughs> you know, you gotta get that, that, that heat busting. And then you can pull off, you know? As for, like, thrifting, I don't know what I'm looking for. Honestly, I want new jeans. Because I'm tired of my jeans. And I have nice jeans. Like, I mean, I showed y'all jean collection. Obviously, I've gotten more pairs of jeans now. But I'm tired of them. And I want some more. And I want some more that I can, like, work on. I haven't been working on jeans at all lately. Um, the last time I worked on a pair of jeans is when I showed you guys on camera. And I can't even wear those um, now because they're so, you know, ripped up in the back. I'm going to be cold. Like, people going to look at me like I'm crazy. But, oh, speaking of cold, it is cold as, I don't know. It's so cold outside, especially at my school. It's on a hill. So, like, you know, it's mad windy and i be getting blown away yesterday i had on a sweatsuit going to class my knees felt like they was about to fall off you know what i mean but i think it's because i'm skinny i don't know i feel like skinny people 
we need to we need to um you know bundle up extra because yeah we're gonna turn into an ice cream for real and that's what i felt like i was turning into i was really about to cry oh my god i need gas i'm talking about going all these places and i need gas but there's a gas station right by my school so i'm gonna get some gas i'm gonna wait for my car to warm up probably listen to some music and yeah i wish i could show you guys like a glimpse of my playlist but you know when you're recording you can't really get your music to play unless i record on snapchat i want y'all to hear the good songs i mean, I might do that i might do that but yeah i'm gonna let the car warm up go get some gas and then we out It did not take that long to get here actually and also i kind of messed up in the beginning the mall that i was talking about is in paramus not per se got my peas messed up but i'm still gonna go there it's not that far so yeah but i'm excited to see what this thrift store has last time i was here was literally a year ago and i found some good stuff so um yeah i'm excited hopefully i find some things um purses jeans tops all that stuff um, I found a cute pair of glasses last time I came here, so you know, maybe they have some more. Um, I'm in 20 minute parking, but like, there's literally no parking. Like, I guess everybody and their mother is here. But yeah, somebody else is pulling up next to me. But yeah, I'm about to go in there so I don't waste my time in this parking spot. And yeah. So. <laughs> I'm gonna obviously have to go through what I want and what I don't want, but we're gonna go through these tops. You know? I never meant to hurt 
I'm in the elevator. I only found two shirts that I liked in the women's section, so now I'm going up to the men's. But I did find a lot of jeans. Like I said, I don't know if you guys heard me, but I have to go through these. So. On the second floor, so we're gonna see what the men's section has. Stuff. I think I'm done here. I'm hungry. My stomach is telling me I need to go home. So I'm about to go through this stuff. I am done. Got two bags. Can't show the other one. But I spent $92. You know, I'm not even mad because I needed new clothes. It was mostly jeans. Yo, I got this. I got this brown jacket. And I was, it was $30, it was $29.99. And I was like, I'm not gonna get this, cause like, yeah, that's gonna be most of the price, like what I'm spending. But bro, I tried it on, I said, yeah, gotta get it. It's so nice. But you know me, I'm a sucker for brown, so. Yeah, I didn't plan on spending that much, but you know, whatever. Tax season is coming, so I'm gonna get some money to buy the rest of the stuff I want. <sighs> cause I wanna, um, Mark Jacobs tote bag, but that could wait. Like, the stuff like that can wait. Now I'm gonna go to the mall, get some stuff, if I find anything. So yeah, I got a couple flannels, um, a hoodie, a lot of pair of jeans that I'm so excited to try on. Um, some of them I'm gonna end up like cutting up and stuff because, I mean, that's what I bought some of them for. Some of them are just for wearing. I'm telling them I'm a, I'm a cut up, but overall, I am satisfied with my purchases. I wish they would have had more kind of, you know, cuter stuff in there. If I want cuter stuff, I could go to Plato's Closet for that. Um, by my house, I don't know if there's one over here. I should have checked that out, but um, the Plato's Closet by my house is really good, so I might go there in a couple months or like next month i don't know bro i don't know depends on when i want to go thrifting again or if my friends want to go thrifting whatever whatever but now i'm gonna go to the mall in paramus they have a nice food court there so yeah i think i might get chipotle i had smash burger yesterday and it was bussing but yeah and i don't want chick-fil-a i think they have chick-fil-a there but i don't want that i always get that i might get Actually, Chipotle sounded kind of good. I always get Chipotle too. Yeah, but my stomach is saying I'm hungry, feed me now. And I'm like, all right, girl, because she be wilding. But yeah, I'm about to head to the mall, y'all. Um, I literally forgot what I was going to say because the music started playing and cut the freaking camera off. I have no clue what I was going to say. All right, forget it. Forget it. I'll see y'all later. We don't really want to touch this one. Get away. Say? Sit right next to you. So I'm at the mall. Um, it was literally only like an 11 minute drive here from the thrift store. So that was not bad at all. And I'm only like a couple minutes away from my dorm hall. So, you know, 
but in here where do i want to go h&m of course zara of course even though zara is mad expensive i still be going in there hopefully they have some cute stuff for a cheap price because yeah where else do i want to go maybe do they have everything in here i'm pretty sure they do i might go in there where else honestly like i just be shopping everywhere and if i see something cute then i pick it up and i buy it but yeah mostly i want to get some food mm, i'm probably not gonna record myself eating my food and showing y'all my food well i'm gonna show you my food but yeah you know how people in the food court they be mad nervous. <laughs> oh i remembered what i was gonna say i was gonna say i'm I apologize for not recording that much in the thrift store like me shopping and stuff because it's kind of hard to shop and record at the same time like I have to I have to concentrate on what I'm trying to buy and filming just makes it 10 times harder so probably might be the same situation here I am gonna show you guys what I picked up when I get back to my dorm do a little try on haul type thing at the end of this video I know it's kind of dirty because of the the thrift store clothes but i'm gonna take a shower is that dirty still i mean i'm gonna take a shower and i'm gonna wash the clothes so yeah tomorrow sunday a chill day I'm gonna wash some clothes and start putting my clothes away in the bins but yeah i'm hungry so i'm about to get out and go to the mall Ooh, baby, baby, came in here and Zara's having a sale. Oh shoot. Let's go upstairs to the women's. Yo, every time I come to Zara and I'm trying to shop, like when I get money, they be having a sale. Oh my God, stuff is on sale. I'm so excited. Ah. y'all so i got some stuff from zara i got two pair of jeans and i got a shirt um but yeah i was not expecting them to have a sale my airpods died in case y'all can't hear me but now i'm about to go i'm about to go look for h&m but i'm satisfied i got a lot of new jeans today so now i can't say i don't have jeans because i have them and i'm excited to try them on the fitting room was closed after i go to h&m I'm gonna go get some food and then go to Forever 21. I don't feel like finding it because it took me a while to find H&M, I'm not going to lie. Um, I'm about to get some food, I'm trying to find the food court, and then I probably, after I eat, I'm going to be ready to go. So I'm not going to go to Forever 21. I did enough shopping today. Um, the rest of the stuff I could probably buy online. Like if I want more tops and stuff, I'll just go online shopping because as much as I like shopping in person because I'm more of an in-person shopper I like to see it feel it try it on all that stuff it's it's much cheaper online you just get more for your money so 
that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna shop on Boohoo and Nasty Gal, Misguided, all of that type of stuff. Plus, yeah, I gotta save my money because I'm getting my hair done on Wednesday. We're gonna find the food court, eat, and then go. And then when I get back to my dorm, I forgot I was going to my dorm real quick. I gotta bring all these bags and they're gonna be looking at me at the front desk like, girl. But, um, yeah, I'm gonna try the stuff on for y'all. So, yeah. Hey guys, so I'm back in my car. Finished shopping, mall is closed. And I got a couple things. I got two pair of jeans from Zara. They were having a sale. Not the whole store, but they had like a nice little section for the men downstairs and then the women upstairs. And they had like everything on sale. I got two pairs of jeans and they were both $12.99. I'm so excited because Zara jeans are fire, right? And I got a shirt from Zara. And then I went to H&M and I got a couple of tops because I need more tops. I just bought hella jeans from the thrift store and I bought jeans at Zara. So I was like, okay, that's enough for the jeans. I got enough jeans. You know, I'm going to need more sooner or later throughout the year because, you know, I get tired of my jeans fast. But, yeah, I got some tops. I got jeans. And then I went to Bath and Body Works and they were having a sale on the, the perfumes for $6.50. So I got one perfume and then I went to eat. I did not show you guys what I was eating because I was just eating and talking on the phone and stuff like that. But instead of Chick-fil-A or Chipotle, I got Jerk Shack Grill, something like that. Great. It was good. Um, I didn't get to finish my food because I got full and yeah but I would definitely be eating that for dinner and all of that stuff. I'm probably going to end my night by watching a movie and eating my food and just having a good time. Today was a great day. I'm glad that I decided to go out and like you know enjoy myself and just go out and hang out with myself. You know you got to do that sometimes. It's self care and it's retail therapy you know what I mean and I've been complaining about how I needed new clothes. So I was just like, you know what, Adia? Go buy yourself some clothes. Like, don't even worry. Like, I was trying so hard to, like, savor the cash that I got for for Christmas. I'm like, I know what I want to buy. I want to buy a tote bag. Tote bag. I want to buy a uh, My Mom Made It bag. I want to buy boot. Like, I wanted moon boots. But, like, I could get that stuff anytime, you know? I need clothes before I need a bag, you know? So, yeah, I also need to get more sneakers. So next time I get money or whatever or a nice little check and I feel like splurging on myself, I'm going to get myself some shoes because I haven't got myself any new sneakers um, in a minute. And, yeah, it just I just have a hard time spending money on myself if it's not food. And I need to stop being a cheapskate. I'm about to go back to my dorm and try on all the clothes for you guys like i promised because that's gonna happen anyway i'm gonna be trying on the clothes so i might as well show y'all so yeah stay tuned for that and i'll be back later hey y'all so i'm back at my dorm and i have all my bags and i'm ready to show you guys what i got hold on let me make a thumbnail Okay, so I just made a thumbnail real quick. I'm back at my dorm, um, and I'm just gonna try everything on and show you guys what I picked up at the store. I'm gonna try to make it quick because my phone is on like 30 something percent, and I low key wanna eat and just chill and lay down and take these boots off and just relax. So, yeah, let's get into it. Okay, so first we're going to start off with the stuff that I thrifted. Should I show y'all my whole body? No. Alright, so this is the stuff that I thrifted. And first things first, I'm going to show y'all this jacket. Got this brown jacket. Size medium and bro. I was contemplating on whether I should get this, but look. can't tell me nothing this is $29 I'm loving it I'm not gonna put the hood on because it's dirty but I'm gonna zip it up fire W jackets like this 
really cute. I love it. And this was on the rack with like all the fur coats and stuff. They were expensive because I'm guessing they were real fur. This is probably fake. That's why it's $29, but I really like it. So yeah, this is the first item. Next, I got a sweater. It says New Jersey. Cause you know, I love my state or whatever. I'm gonna try this on. Um, hopefully I don't mess up my hair doing this. Trying on all these tops and stuff. I'm trying my best not to. That's so cute. I like it. I'm messing with it. This is so cute. Yes. Cause I remember one time I have a sweater that says Washington DC, right? Because you know, it's a souvenir sweater. And I was at, I was going to Morgan at the time and I was walking around with it cause it's comfortable. And some boy was like, oh, she's from DC. I'm gonna be styling this sweater cute way. You know, I could wear it cropped and all of that stuff. So yeah, and I like the color. Very cute. So I got two two flannels and one more top from them. And then I got a bunch of jeans. So this is the first flannel. It's like a brown and beige and you guys and gray. And you guys know I like my earth tones. So well it's not really a flannel, it's a button down, but I'ma wear it as like a flannel. Wear it over things. And this is how it is. Very nice. Got this from the men's section, of course. This is it. Mm, I like it. It's very, like the collar is very sharp. But I'm liking it. You could put it I could put it under some stuff. Um, like under a little crew neck sweater or something like that. But yeah. Next flannel button down is this green one. And this is Tommy Hilfiger. This is really nice. I love the color. Love the green. I don't really have a green. I only have one green uh, pullover. Not pullover. Button down. And yeah. This is cute. Yeah. Ah! This is so cute. This is. I love it. Mm -hmm. I love this one. This one is so cute. Look at the colors. It's green and blue and like a really light yellow. Kind of looks beige, but yeah. Feeling it, feeling it. Then I have this little shirt. I'm gonna take this graphic tee off and show you guys what the sweater looks like on top of this shirt. So, like a little cardigan and it's kind of distressed. I really like it and my idea, you know me, I love a turtleneck. So I was like, I can wear a cute little turtleneck under this and make it look cute with something. I got this from the women's section. It's the shirt with it. Just this shirt with it, that's not, I'm not feeling it, but it's kind of cute. I'm gonna wear it one day. It's giving, this outfit is giving grandma, giving soccer mom. No, I'm not feeling it. But yeah, those are all my tops from thrifting. And I'm gonna show you all my jeans. Okay, so I lowered it so you can see my full body. And this is a better angle for y'all. Y'all can see everything. Y'all don't need to see my feet because I'm not trying on any shoes. But I'm gonna take these boots off. My boots, I got compliments on them today. But like every time I wear them, I get compliments on them because they look like the Prada boots, but they're Steve Madden. They have the little pocket on the sides. But I got them in white and I really need to clean them off because they're getting dirty. Can't have the white boots looking like cream, you know? Okay, first pair of jeans that I thrifted. About to show y'all. So I got these Levi's and they're a size 28-32. And these were in the women's sections, but by the measurements, I think they're men's jeans, but a size 28 seems like they will fit me. So yeah, I'm gonna show you those. Okay, so this is the first pair. They make my butt look really cute. I expected them to be baggy, not gonna hold you, but they're giving. 
they're kind of like tight around the thighs. Um, I got some thighs for a little skinny thing, you know. <laughs> it's giving. One thing about me, if I see a pair of Levi jeans and they're nice, I'm going to get it. Because Levi's are like timeless and I just love them. They're good quality and yeah, the denim is like really good. So if I wanted to cut them up, I could. But these are a nice pair of like regular jeans over here falling but yeah i like them um, these jumble up nice at the bottom so they would probably look cute with some low top sneakers this how they look close booty look a little crazy but yeah next pair i have a pair of ralph Lauren jeans for women they're size two I don't know, like the way they're shaped is kind of weird, but I just thought they was gonna make my butt look nice. So if they don't, I might give them to my friends and I, cause if they don't fit me, they'll probably fit her. On to the next pair. I wish I could see the floor, like. These are ugly. I knew I shouldn't have bought these. I'm giving them this an eye. Look at the bun. What the heck? You know what? This isn't this is ugly. I'm not gonna spend too much time on these. On to the next. I had faith in these. These are nice. I like them a lot. Look at this distressing on the pockets and their flare jeans. They're size two, I think. No, they're size 25. So, yeah, I had faith in these. These don't look right. I'm going to be highly upset. Okay, y'all. Let's give it up for the low-rise jeans. Ah, look. My butt is not saying nothing right now. But the tummy is, okay? It's giving Y2K. Y2K, babe, on the stomach. What? Cute. Yes. I wanted these to fit. And they flare at the bottom. Obviously, I'm too short. Whenever I get flare jeans, they're very long on me. So I have to wear like a boot or something so that you could actually like see the flare and I cuff it a little bit so that, you know. But. I like them. I could wear them with some heels, with a little crop top. You know, you gotta wear. I got a little baby tee today too, so I could wear the flare jeans with the baby tee. Yo, somebody stop me! It's like nah. <laughs> so that's all I got from the thrift store, and the fact that this stuff came to ninety two dollars. It's not sitting right with me, but um, yeah, we're gonna get into. What I got from Zara, cause I'm trying the Zara jeans, and then I'm gonna show you the H&M tops, and then that's gonna be it. So the first pair of Zara jeans are these. I have shorts on, but I just don't want them. They have rips in the knee. They're kind of like straight, and it's kind of like it's it's like a it's called straight full length, but it looks like a mom jean at the top. So yeah, and I got them in a size. 32 which is a us zero so hopefully they fit good because i got a size zero zero jeans from them and they're mom jeans and they're starting to feel like really small and i have to suck in to put them on and i know it's size two is going to be too big so hopefully this zero fits perfectly fine these are the jeans um they're a little tight i feel like the two would have fit but they didn't have a two in these yeah, but they fit my waist nice. And I don't know how I feel about how the butt looks. I don't know. I feel like the jeans make it look a little long. But I don't know. I feel like the figure, the figure looks nice. Like the jeans are cute. They fit the thighs mm -hmm. nice. It's just around here. Yeah. I like them though. Uh oh. The butt don't look that bad. It was $12.99. I mean, I'm going to have to. Good. 
Because if I could fit, if I could squeeze myself in a pair of double zero jeans, I'm gonna squeeze myself into these size zero jeans, and that's just that. All right. Okay. And I really like the knees. These are cute. I like them. I like them a lot. All right. Next pair of jeans. I have these. These are nice. I don't know what style they're supposed to be. Doesn't say. But um, yeah, hopefully these fit well. And yeah, also I do have a pair of shorts underneath here. So maybe that's why they're a little tight fitting. And yeah. Okay, these are the next pair of jeans. <sighs> Took me a minute to get them up. I was having zipper problems, but booty. So these are not as tight. I definitely know I can go a size up in Zara now. Um, I thought they ran big, but it seems like they fit like a regular size zero and a regular size zero zero. The fly kept opening and the waist, it's the waist, like Zara's waistline. I, I understand that they're trying to like make it that like girls with smaller waistlines can fit the jeans as well as it, as it fits the butt, but dang like it's it's squeezing the waist but i think they fit nice <gasps> makes me feel like i need to like a stomach all the way in so it's not squeezing me but they're definitely not as tight i could you know actually <clears throat> i don't wear them i don't care they're cute oh and they they open at the bottom like this so yeah i like them they make my butt look nice. And yeah. These actually fit me cuter than the other jeans. They fit my butt better. But yeah, now I'm gonna show you the shirt I got from Zara. And then the rest of the tops that I got from H&M. So this is a top I got from Zara. It's Coca-Cola, it's kind of corny, but I like the back. I love stuff that has, I like shirts that have stuff on the back. So this is the shirt basic white tee cute in the back i'll have to wear this with something nice so that it doesn't look as corny i need more long sleeve shirts so that's why i got it regular tee you know it's okay and this is all the tops that i got from h&m so i'm gonna show you those and then that'll be the rest the end of the video so this is the first top I was excited to try this one on, that's why I'm trying it on first. And it's a long sleeve shirt with thumb holes, and it says no fear. And it's kind of like, you know, it's a cropped mock neck shirt. So yeah. Y'all, ah, this is so cute, right? I like it. And it kind of has like these things, so it kind of looks like, you know, you tucked it into your bra. These pants are making me look like I have love handles and I don't even have them. I love this shirt. This is such a cute shirt. I gotta find an outfit to go with it. Should I do a lookbook? But yeah, this is the first shirt. I like it. Very cute. Very girly. Not really girly, but like, you know, sexy. Ah, and what? And, and. Okay, next shirt. Next shirt is this graphic tee. It says metallic. Very nice, I like it. Love it, automatically love it. Yes, this is cute. This is my style. This is a size small too, it's an oversized shirt. I love it. I'm gonna have it like this. I could, nah, I don't want to tie it in the front, but I like having it hang to the side like that. I like the color. I like the the neck, you know, it's like a crew neck. And yeah, I like the green. I'm just, I like the shirt, okay? And that's just that. That's just a, a, a. Next shirt, I have a baby tee. Black baby tee, it's not a baby tee. It's a black shirt, but I got a size extra small so that it can fit like a baby tee. Yeah. Y'all, uh, this is so cute. It fits exactly how I wanted it. 
I thought it was gonna be like a little flared out a little, but no. I got a little bit of deodorant on it. And this is how it looks with the um the flare pants. I like it. And it comes down a little further. So you know you get a little bit of the midriff. <laughs> it fits cute, like a muscle tee kinda. I like it. I like it. I'm gonna be rocking this. What? Especially with my black leggings. I got these cute black leggings. This would be cute in it. And I usually don't like fitted crop tops. But this is not even like a crop top. It's like a short shirt. That's what a crop top is. But you know, like it comes right here. Crop tops usually come here. And I like it right here. Yeah, this is fire. And I got it in a size extra small so it can be tight. Because a size small wouldn't fit me tight like this. And I like how the the collar comes all the way up. Like, I like how it's not like right here. It comes all the way up. So, yeah. Next shirt is a mock neck blue, long sleeve. And yeah, I just got it because it's cute. I like crop tops. I mean, no, I like turtlenecks, mock necks, all that neck. So. <laughs> I'm obsessed with this shirt. The most basic shirt I got, I'm obsessed with it. Like, I look like I should be in a 90s sitcom, don't I? <laughs> or a Y2K show. It's the pants, it's the pants. So this is the shirt. Honestly, whenever I wear this shirt, I'm probably gonna tuck it into my bra. You can see my bra right now, don't mind that. I have on like a light pink. And you need like a black bra. I don't know if I like that better. I think I, I like the top, but I don't know. Maybe if I put it in a dryer and it could fit around here more because it's like not doing it. I like the color of the mock neck. Honestly, it's not that bad that it doesn't hug me. You know, I'm kind of slim, so everything is not going to hug me, but. It's not that bad. I'll wear it with a cute pair of baggy jeans or whatever. Yeah, cause I like to wear the fitted top baggy jeans look. So yeah, next shirt. Last shirt is this orange turtleneck. Y'all, I got this for $6.99, $7.99. And look, I have every turtleneck color in the book and I had to add orange to it. Also, you know how I added blue? had to add orange and this is the actual turtleneck it's not a mock neck i'm excited and it matches these yes ma'am i needed more shirts to match these shoes so yeah that's what i got y'all do you hear me when i say i love this shirt look it fits so nice I'm gonna cover it because my bra is like belonging me. And I don't like that. Like it's literally seen through. So you're gonna have to wear like a, a black bra with this. But it's so cute. I like the color. And also, I wouldn't wear it with these jeans. Not at all. It's not giving with these jeans, it's giving soccer mom. But definitely with these. Because the stitching fire so unfortunately guys i can't show you guys what the pants look like i was gonna try on this shirt with the first pair of zara jeans i put on i did put them on and they came up on me a lot better because i took the shorts off so they fit really good now but um my phone is running out of storage. I had to delete some stuff. So I'm gonna hurry up and do this outro. Thank you guys for watching. I had a great time filming this video for you guys. I also had a great time today, you know, just dabbling into some retail therapy. We all need it. It's a, it's a form of self care. And I feel like whatever makes you happy, just do it. Like take yourself out sometimes and just go ham so that's what i did today i'm satisfied with the majority of my purchases and i'm glad that i went out today and didn't sit up in the house and you know not do anything as i always say i'm gonna try to be more consistent because i've really been slacking and i want to put out more content for you guys and just you know 
do what I could do. Make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe. Share this video with a friend. Help me get to 10K because that's what we're on the road to. Turn on post notifications so you can be notified of my next post as well. Yeah, just stay tuned for the next video. Um, I don't know what it's going to be yet. Maybe a lookbook, maybe another vlog. Who knows? But just know it's going to be great because it's coming for me. So yeah. <laughs> Bye guys and I'll see you in the next one.